what's up guys and welcome back to the channel so if you're new make sure to subscribe for more take and money related videos so subscribe and help me get to 4k subscribers that would really mean a lot to me in this video i'll be showing you on how you can buy bitcoin using an application called paxful and to be specific i'll be showing you on how you can purchase your bitcoin using your visa slash debit card so if that sounds interesting then let's hop into the video so i'll open my app So what I want to go now is click on marketplace, drop down the option and then <coughs> the cryptocurrency that we want to buy is not Ethereum and it's neither USDT but it's Bitcoin. So click on Bitcoin, you, where you want to click next is you drop down the filter and then you should make sure that the currency that you enter is the same as the country. So put USA since it's USD. Okay, so once all that is set, then you click on any payment method. So you drop down that menu and then you can see that there are various payment methods. So you can buy Bitcoin using bank transfer. You can buy using online wallets. You can buy using gift card. You can buy using cash payment. You can buy using credit slash debit card. You can buy using digital currencies and you can buy using goods and services. So in this video, we'll specifically focus on how you can buy using your debit card. So I'll put the link in the description below where I created a video on how you can buy using bank transfer. So I'll click on credit card. And you can see those are my options. So I'll click on Visa Debit slash Credit Card. So once you've selected Visa Card, you scroll down and see which options are compatible with your account to be specific so as you can see they are yellow in there because each specific vendor or seller has requirements and my account doesn't meet the requirements that these vendors have set for them to transact with people so you do not meet the requirements set by the vendor so the vendor is the same as the seller so the thing about Paxful you cannot buy any cryptocurrencies directly you need more like a third party so you transfer the vendor money into the account or into the banking details that they will give you and then they'll confirm receipt of the money and then they release the bitcoin into your account so one of the vendors that i can use to buy my bitcoin is this one bitbase xi and one thing as well that i would love to to caution you with is you should make sure that the vendor is verified and they've got a good recommendation which is a good number of likings and they've been using Paxful for at least a decent period of time so i'll click on this one as you can see it's got more likes compared to these others that we are seeing this one has 214 the one below him has 331 so i'll click on bitbase xi so i'll enter the amount of bitcoin i want to buy in usd so let's say i want to buy bitcoin with 150 us dollars so that's how much bitcoin i'm going to have which is 0 0.00284422 so the vendor has been verified which is the email has been verified the phone number the id and proof of address so these are the feedbacks that they've been getting with the people that they've traded so as you can see this this vendor had a trade today he sold Bitcoin to someone today. And this is the, this is the recommendation that they've given. So the recommendation is BitBase is quick and easy. So as you can see, they are recommending that he's good and his services are great, fast and responsive, fast fast service. So okay, this is fair enough. So this is 19 March 16. So you can see that he looks fairly decent to trade with. So that's a few information about, uh, about, the, about the vendor. So if you're satisfied with what you're seeing with the vendor, you enter your amount then you hit buy by the way he's not the only vendor there are other various vendors that you can select from so upon selecting buy you see you receive a message instantly from Paxful telling you that your trade has entered into an escrow fund so an escrow is simply a secure way in which you can purchase things online in which it can only be considered complete if both parties meet the needs so if i send so that is if I send the money to the seller and the seller releases the Bitcoin into my account. This is when this transaction will be considered successful and complete. So an escrow form of transaction is a very safe and secure online way of purchasing items. So you receive another 
another message which is an email telling you that telling you the amount of bitcoin you want to buy in that you can proceed with your transaction so as you can see um i've received another message telling me that uh, this vendor has texted me so hello welcome to that that and uh, so this is what they are requiring me to do in order for them in order for them to give me the banking details that i'll use to transfer the money into the account for them to release the bitcoin so after you read through so as you can see photo of your id driver's license selfie number and so you can read on so so you can communicate actually to the seller so you can see how safe is it so after if, so after you've had a decent conversation with uh, you can simply ask them to release or to give you the banking details where you're going to forward the money then you log out of parks for application you go to your bank app you forward the money to the banking details that they've given you you take a screenshot of sending the money and you come back you paste it in here and you confirm with them that you've sent them the money which is 150 us dollars so you wait you patiently wait for them to release the bitcoins into your account and the transaction will be considered successful and the ESCAL fund will be considered complete so this is basically it about this video guys hope you've learned one or two things and if you have make sure to give this video a thumbs up thank you for staying this far stay safe and i'll check you out in the next video peace